Jamen, øh, tak fordi, at de er kommet her og så vil høre lidt omkring øh, vores øh, teknologi her i, øh, i Visblu. Visblu is a development company that commercializes uh, vanadium redox flow batteries. In uh, vanadium flow batteries, you store the electricity in uh, liquids, and that's opposed to uh, normal uh, batteries where you store it in uh, solids. I always had an uh, idea or a, you know a vision or something that I wanted to start my own company uh, some way or the other. The technology transfer office had a huge and important role in, in the realization of uh, VisBlue. I think if it had not been because of them, I don't think that VisBlue had existed uh, nowadays. TTO provided some people that could actually help us with uh, looking at the business development and the business plan. For scientists, uh, I think there is a large entrance barrier uh, to, to creating a, a spin-out company. Even in the case where you want to do it by yourself without investors, you, you need to, to create a company. Uh, there's a lot of paperwork there, you need an accountant. It's a completely new field and, and people are probably you know, afraid to fail. My most important advice for scientists who wants to start a spin-out company is that they really have to identify uh, where they want to go and that is of course also uh, business-wise. What do they want to sell and where do they want to sell it to? And that also requires identification of, uh, of your weak sites, what, what is missing, and then try to identify people that can help you on these weak sites. Actually, I do feel a little proud that I, you know, been able to uh, creating a company. Uh, it's, you know, you see that uh, that that uh, stuff you're working with research-wise also have some applications in the society, and there are actually people who believes in in these ideas, and and that's uh, for me that's uh, important.